Hello everybody, welcome back to another AI video. In this one, we're in CapCut and we're using their first AI video generator, an AI video maker, and it is fantastic. It can turn any idea into a social ready video just by chatting. No switching between five different apps. You talk, it writes, it produces, and you post. And you get 10 free uses to try it out. It's wild, let me show it to you. All right, so here's exactly what it does and how I use it on mobile. Piece of cake, click on the CapCut icon like I've done here, it opens it up. And then for me, I click on AI Lab and then when you do that, you'll see AI Video Maker. Think of AI Video Maker kind of as a video agent in a chat window, that's a good way to look at it. I tell it what it wants, it drafts a script and then it builds the whole video for me. I don't need to bounce around between apps like the Notes app for the script or a separate editor for the timeline. It's all here, pretty cool. All right, once we've got it open up, just go ahead and click on the prompt here. You can start typing in anything you want. I'm gonna go ahead and paste in a prompt just cause I've gonna been using this for a while here. So here we go, I've got a, here's my prompt. Create a 15 second tutorial called three on camera hooks to grab attention in two seconds for short term vertical video, TikToks, YouTube shorts, that type of thing. Upbeat tone, bold captions, quick cuts, and clear on-screen beats. Again, this can be anything you want. This is just a good example. And then watch this. I'm gonna click on the little uh, blue check mark there and it's gonna start doing some thinking. And then it's going to give me a quick overview or what they call a brief so that I can make sure I get what I want here. So here we go. It's loading up the brief as I talk to you. So, okay, of course, here is a plan for your tutorial video. It's going ahead and selecting the styles. I'm gonna let it do its thing for a few seconds here. I'm gonna come back when it's done. Oh, it's already done. Never mind. It's that fast here. And then here's the brief. Visual style, dynamic, avatar. It's got zoom in marketing teacher. And again, we can go in here and edit this and make changes to this. This is just the first kick at the can. I'm gonna show you all of that in a second here. It selected some background music styles. It's got a duration. It's kind of TikTok-y. And then it's even got an outline in the various different seconds. Now. For this instance, I can go ahead and click on generate if I like it, and I do like it, but if you need to edit it because you want to make some changes, of course, just click that edit button and look at this here. While I got you, we can change the style. Right now, it's set to dynamic, but if I want to go through their styles here, maybe I want to make it futuristic. Why not? There's all of these different styles. I encourage you to look through them here. For the avatar, I can click on the avatar here and I can change it. Again, all of these different types here. Let's see. I'm gonna go ahead with, uh, let's go with this person here. Again, you can go ahead and change all of these. Let's go with that one. It's kind of got that female witcher style. All of this, guys, you could even go ahead and change the outline, but that's neither here nor there. I'll show you some more in a second here about that, but it's available. Once you've got it where you like it, click on the generate button right here and watch this. It says, okay, it's on it. Your video will be generated in a couple of minutes. It only takes a few seconds here. I'm gonna let it do its thing. I'm gonna come back when this is done, show you what we got, and then I'm gonna show you some more options, including how to edit it with just text. It's pretty wild, you'll love it. All right, here we go. So let's see what we got first, and then I'm gonna show you how to edit it. It's a piece of cake. Let's watch it for a few quick seconds here. Three hooks in two seconds. Hey. One, start with a question. Two, okay. make a bold statement. Three, create a pattern interrupt. Follow for more tips. Three. All right, so there you go for a first shot. That is pretty cool, especially because I did this all on my phone, all in CapCut. I didn't have to use any other apps for this. That said, let's go ahead and edit it. So watch this. I'm just going to type in a new prompt here. I'll paste it in to save you some time. And here we go. Add a three-beat countdown at the start. Make the captions in all capitals. Include a simple call to action at the end. Follow for more quick tips. It had a similar one. But here you go. I just made it very specific. And I'll hit the go button. And as you can see here, I can go ahead and just keep typing and changing things until I get exactly what I want. So this is literally editing the video using natural language. I'm gonna come back when this is done. You'll see here it's given me a quick brief here. So it says, hey, I just wanna make sure you got it right here. And again, you can go through the same process I showed you earlier. It looks pretty good to me. I'm gonna click on generate and it's gonna cook it up. I'll come back when it's done and I'll show you a little more. It's gonna blow your mind. All right, welcome back. So let's see what the changes gave us. I can already tell I like it here. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the play button. Let's take a listen and take a look. Three, two, cool. one. Here are three hooks you can steal in the next two seconds. Nice. Start with a question that your audience wants to know the answer to. Make a bold statement they can't ignore. Create a pattern interrupt to stop their scroll. Follow for more quick tips. 
All right, it did all the things I wanted it to do. Three, two, one is in bold. We've got great visuals, guys. This is absolutely wild. Now, if we like it the way it is, and I love it this way, you can just click this export button here up at the top right. But what if you want to make some more changes? I've shown you how to type in your changes, but this is even better. Watch this. Click on edit in the editor. Three, two. There we go. I'm going to close that up here. And you get access to the entire cap cut video editor so not only do you get access to their ai video agent you can edit these like you regularly edit maybe a TikTok video or something you make and you can see here each one of these scenes is clickable so we can adjust them in here and when you do that here for example this one here you can see we can replace it we can trim it we can change the volume on it we can do all of those different things and then watch this if i click on the edit more button this is crazy. Now we get the timeline as well. So we can go ahead and watch this. I'm just going to scroll through. See that? I'm scrolling through this one by one here. And if I want to make changes, we get access to everything down here. All right, so there it is, guys. So remember, once the script feels right, just say, hey, generate my video. And the AI Video Maker will assemble it. And it's going to assemble a complete piece from the script you approved all the way down to the finished video. And it does it in under a minute. You can preview it, you can scan the captions, you can play it back, you can pump it into the timeline editor, so many different things. I recommend you explore it, it's wild. Also keep in mind, if something needs tightening, maybe you wanna shorten a shot or you wanna emphasize a key phrase, adjust the pacing, just go ahead and type in what you want. You can swap out particular moments so you can pull out different sections. And remember, you can regenerate that section without losing anything else. So you can work on it in a compartmentalized way. That said, now I want to show you AI avatar functionality. It is awesome. I run an AI channel and this is right up my alley. If you don't want to be on camera, for example, maybe you just want a consistent presenter, but you don't want to put your face on camera, I got something for you. I'm going to show you how this works. It's awesome. Let's take a look. All right, so here we go. Let's take a look at their AI avatar functionality. It is fantastic. Here we go. Click on AI Video Maker. There we go. We're going to click on Try It. Now, normally you just type in your prompt and you get what you're looking for, like I showed you here. But let's look at Avatar. So I'm going to reset this to Scratch so it's all blank here. Now, the first icon here that I just clicked on, this one here gives you all the different styles. I showed you that earlier. Lots to choose from. But the second icon, this is the one I want to show you next. This is the one that gives you AI avatars and voices and if you're like me for example i run an ai channel this is my niche my face isn't in any of the videos at least not yet not because i'm ugly i don't think just because you know i don't like to have my face on a channel or i want to create you know tutorials and you don't need to be in those videos whatever your reason for it you can click on this here and select any of these many very cool very different different types of avatars now to speed this up here i'm going to click on this lady here with the kind of cool purple hair I select that one because her face is quite big in the shot. Perfect. Again, check any one you want, but this is the one I'm going to go with. Now, the voices, when I click on this, this is going to sample a whole bunch of different voices. Let's take a look here. Now, look, we have all of these voices to choose from, including like SpongeBob styles. They've got baby voices, Santa voices, teddy bear voices, female, male, cartoon voices. You name it, it's all in here. For this one, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go and select Jesse here. You're using the text to speech feature. She has a voice you like. There we go. So you heard her voice. It's very, very good. So there we go. We've gone ahead. We've selected an avatar style. We've selected a voice. Let's go back into the prompt now and let's just go. I don't know. We're going to go a lady speaking to a French bulldog and again this is very simple you guys can go nuts and put in a big long fancy prompt i just want to show you the functionality i'm gonna hit the go button here it's gonna take a few seconds here it's gonna do a little thinking it's going to go ahead and generate like before it's gonna ask me if this is what i want to go with and i can edit it so let's just give that a second here all right welcome back so that took a few seconds here and off we go got it it's creating a video of a lady talking to a french bulldog before i pull the you know i hit the go button on it here you'll see video brief it's got a realistic film style it's got the Astrid Fashion Bedroom Avatar that I chose. I guess that's the fancy name for it. Her name's Astrid. And again, aspect ratio, background music duration. You can at any time go in here and change this. So if some of the scenes 
aren't exactly what you want, just click the edit button like I did before, and boom, go in and edit it. Now, this and that's before we generate, but let's generate and see what we get here. I'm gonna click the go button here. It's gonna generate, it'll take a few seconds here. I'm gonna come back when that's done. I'm gonna show you what we got, and we're gonna wrap it all up. All right, here we go. So let's see what we got here. Already could tell that that is the exact avatar that we selected. Let's hit play and see what we got. Well, hello there, you little rascal. <laughs> You're the king of this castle, aren't you? Well, hello there, you little rascal. Perfect. Now, I didn't say how long the video needed to be or any of that stuff. I just wanted to show you that the AI avatar functionality works exactly as advertised. It is wild. This is a great way to make tutorials, AI videos like the ones I make, anything that you don't want your face or your friend's faces or anything like that in the shots, and you got something to say, this is another great way to do it, guys. AI is in CapCut. It is fantastic. I've put a link in the description below. Let me know what you think, and thanks for watching.